There he is. The man who drowned in his own rising tide. Come back to apologize to me for stealing my shot at WWE and immediately throwing it away? <laughs> Look, I am not apologizing for anything, okay? All I want to say is that we don't need to have each other's backs, but with what Baron is planning to do, the least we could do is have each other's respect, all right? So, are we good? <laughs> oh, yeah. We're so good? I thought I'd introduce you to my new character I'm trying out tonight. You remember how Matt Bloom didn't like Mr. CQ and decided to give you a tryout instead of me? Sure. Smart decision. I'm calling myself Black Hole Coal because I have an energy so intense, nothing can escape it. <sighs> what? Oh, you don't like it? Why? Not a fan of masks these days? <laughs> you know, I find it really interesting that I was attacked by somebody wearing a mask, and next time I see you, you have a mask. Not to mention, you also had all the motivation in the world to do it. Hmm. You're right. It was me. So what are you gonna do about it? Uh, you better tell me the truth right now. It wasn't me! I, I, I had a match that night 300 miles away. I got the gas receipts to prove it. But I could have hired somebody to do it. What? There was a joke! Man, relax! You're real funny. Real funny. We'll see who's laughing after our match tonight. get revenge on whoever told him that new name was a good idea. Hey, Triple H, I know you're watching. Impressed with what you see so far? Well, sorry, you had a shot at signing these two and you blew it. They're BCW for life now. Just a reminder, this match is Falls Count Anywhere in the general parking lot area, as we didn't pay to have the street closed. BCW is getting bigger, but we're not traffic control big yet, okay? We have a sold-out, record-setting crowd here for BCW tonight. by far the hottest ticket in town. Take that, bingo night at St. Mary's Church. This takes me back to the marathon beatdown between Owen Schwartz and Mason Junin for the title. doesn't live in his van. We apologize if anyone's having difficulty with your favorite stream. To be honest, we underestimated the demand to see Buzz in action. We'd offer refunds, but hey, 
this event streaming from a high school parking lot. So what'd you expect? That's what BCW is all about. Fan interaction. You don't just come and watch a BCW show. You're a part of it. You taking notes, Triple H? For those of you who are late to the party, welcome to BCW's very first streaming pay-per-view, where Buzz, that's his name now if you've been living under a rock, and Black Hole Cole, okay, are facing each other in a Falls Count Anywhere match. This takes me back to the marathon beatdown between Owen Schwartz and Mason Cunin for the title. Black Hole Cole still feels like Buzz stole his WWE opportunity, and now he's out for revenge. He should also get revenge on whoever told him that new name was a good idea. That was amazing! The live crowd loved it. You managed to avoid wrecking the principal's car, and the pay-per-view buys were off the charts. You two will be getting nice bonus checks in the mail for that. <laughs> oh, uh, I'll hand deliver yours since the last time I checked, you can't send mail to Vans. <laughs> that was quite the battle. It was. Uh, sorry about your windshield. It's okay. Baron said he'd pay for it. <laughs> hey, you're a lot tougher than I thought you were. You proved that tonight. And I didn't really get it before, but now I'm starting to understand why they're calling you Buzz. It's pretty much just Baron calling me that. It's gonna catch on. You'll see. Well, my bad for getting fired up about the mask earlier. We good? We're good. That's great, guys, but don't get too friendly because you'll be facing each other again soon in an even bigger rematch. I just need time to build something. Baron, since when have you built anything ever? Well, I'm not actually building it myself, but I am designing it. In the meantime, I have some great opportunities for both of you to build off the success of tonight's show. Cole, an up-and-coming promotion in Japan wants you to go wrestle for them. Ho oh, ho ho! Even Japan can't escape the energy of Black Hole Coal. <laughs> right. Actually, they explicitly said to not do that character. They just want Cole Quinn. And Buzz, we are headed south of the border for a match versus Mexico's hottest luchador, El Mago! Es increíble! What? I took a few years of Spanish in high school. What? Guess that'll be useful on our trip. Hey, big things are happening for us in BCW. It's all coming together. Now, what do you say we bring it in for a big celebratory BCW handshake? Yeah. Uh, uh, ha! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Wakey, wakey, earthquakey. We're having an earthquake? No, no, no. Just playing the wrestler wake up game, man. Relax. You might want to choose a less terrifying wrestler name next time. Yeah, noted. We made it. 
Already? It really didn't seem like we were driving two days. Gee, I wonder why. It's because you've been asleep the entire two days. Hey, I need my genius promoter rest. Uh-huh. How do you say I need a shower in Spanish? Necesita un shower? I don't know. I don't remember the word for shower. <laughs> You're a lot of help. Did you see that? What? That masked guy who attacked me, he's here. I just saw him. I think you're seeing things from being awake for so long. I'm telling you that was him. How about you get some rest before your big match tonight? We need to keep all our momentum going. Can't have any setbacks due to hallucinations yet. That wasn't a hallucination. All right. Wait, stop, pull over! What, what is it? Did you see him? No, I want to try some authentic Mexican street corn. You're the worst. Charan. Esta lucha ha sido increíble. Como nos dijo Baron Blade toda la semana pasada. Impresionante la lucha libre de vos. Tal vez hizo su tarea. Vos ha ganado todas sus luchas, pero el mago tiene sus trucos. Noche hermosa. Hace buen tiempo mientras estamos afuera. Tal vez el mago lo controla. Los dos luchadores al punto de convertirse en superestrellas. ¿Quién será? ¿Quién va a ser? ¿Qué pasa aquí? Es el enmascarado que atacó al boss en el evento de WWE. ¡Qué horror! ¡Terrible! ¡Qué lástima que esta lucha tremenda termina así! ¡Llévaselo de aquí! ¡Sácalo! ¿Now do you believe me? I guess so. Look. I don't know why you're doing this. But I am not going to let you try to ruin my career ever again. Lo siento. Soy un fan y solo quería atención. Perdóname, por favor. What's he saying? Did he admit to everything? No. He's a fan. He's just craving attention. He's a copycat. He's not the same guy. Let him go. Gracias, señor. Oye, ¿puedo tener un autógrafo?
You have a marker. You're a better man than I am. Don't do that again, Buzz. Gracias. Well, your big Mexico debut didn't go quite as planned, but the match was great up until the end. And any publicity is good publicity, right? You've still got the buzz going. Yeah, I guess. I'm gonna take a shower. You mean ducha? I looked it up. So, this is what you had to build for our big rematch, right? What is it, a tetanus tornado match? Yep, it's a beauty, don't you think? I'd say it's more beast than beauty. Well, its official name is the Scrap Trap. Not only are we going to have our biggest streaming audience yet, we're doing it in one of WWE's most iconic venues. It's like we're invading their territory. Man, I wish I could see the look on Triple H's face when he sees this. Where did this even come from? Where did you dig this up? All over. I salvaged it from other wrestling promotions, a junkyard scrap. That section is from WCW's Triple Cage. That is from an ECW cage, and I believe that side used to be an old prison fence. <laughs> Pretty neat, huh? I think a better name would be Death Trap. This violates every health code known to mankind. <laughs> yeah, it does.
Guys, that truly topped anything you've ever done before. But I'm afraid I got some bad news. What? Yeah, what happened? Our pay-per-view stream went down in the middle of your match. No one watching online got to see how it ended. <sighs> Did the site crash or something? What happened? No, we were taken down intentionally by Triple H. Triple H? How could he even do that? He and WWE's lawyers are claiming they have exclusive rights to broadcast from this venue. <sighs> Damn it! And now we're getting flooded with refund requests. Don't think you're getting any bonus checks for this show, guys. I'm sorry. Does either of you know if you can return slightly used jet skis? I might have jumped the gun on purchasing a couple. We'll circle back to that later. First, Triple H unfairly pulls my contract from defending myself from an attack, and now he's trying to sabotage our business? We have to strike back. They have a team of lawyers and an endless supply of cash. You guys just competed in a cage made from an old prison fence. What could we possibly do to them? Well, you said it earlier. Tonight was like we're invading their territory, right? So, what if we actually did that? What do you mean? I mean, we hit Triple H exactly where it hurts the most by- Selling him used jet skis. Invading NXT. Invading NXT. Totally on the same page as you, Buzz. I don't know about this, guys. It seems risky. Why? We've both been rejected by WWE, so what do we have to lose, right? And this is what you wanted, Baron. You wanted this. You said it yourself. Our plan was to stick it to Triple H. So what do you say? I think we're gonna need a really big stick? That's what I'm talking about! <laughs> 